42. You know what? We're counting down to summer. The unofficial start of the season, of course, just a few days away. Memorial Day weekend coming up, and that has us thinking about experiencing the outdoors. Yeah, and this week we've been talking to our viewers about the top patios across Metro Detroit to take in a meal. 7 Action News reporter Matthew Smith joins us live from St. Clair Shores, and Matt sounds like and looks like you've got a pretty good view out there. Yeah, we've made it to Mike's on the water, and, and this is because uh, it's one of my personal favorites that our viewers are recommending. Gotta love the water, but before we talk to the owner here, we also want to talk about the rounding out of our top seven list. We gave you four at 545, so I told you earlier we're not going to just stick in the city of Detroit, right? So what about Washington Township? Brown Iron Brew House may look new, but the craft beer game is strong. They boast three straight years of awards for Michigan's top brewer. Pair that with barbecue, cornhole tournaments. It's a favorite of the locals and worth a trip if you're not there. How about Birmingham? The Soul Social Kitchen and Bar will give you different things. They boast high scores and rave reviews for food via Yelp, Google, and others. But the rooftop patio well, it gets you away from the traffic, and the cocktails are great. But I mentioned that we're at Mike's on the Water because we're right here uh, near Lake St. Clair. One of the best spots to eat. I'm told by everybody that this place is fantastic, not just for the views, but for the food. And because of you, Mike, the owner, uh, what, what makes this place special to you? Oh, well, thank you very much for coming. And uh, Kevin, our weatherman, get me some sunshine. <laughs> I think that this place has just got so much character. I use the uh, cool, comfortable, casual, and cozy concept, and we got so many things that people bring to me. We hang on the walls, including their boat pictures, and everybody comes in and says, there I am, there I am, there I am, and it's right in the water. We have boat docking here, and when that sun shines out, uh, everybody's coming down this canal off the lake and having a good burger and a cold beer. So it's a special place with the much character. You can come up via boat, you can drive here, you can get here either way, but at the end of the day, you're giving them a good atmosphere. Tell me, you started with 80 some seats, now you're over 300. Yes. You just kept growing. Yes, we've grown since uh, we opened in 2011 May with uh, a little bit over 80 seats. I'm now over 300 seats. We uh, did the deck expansion in 2012 and 2014. Last year, I put another uh, 50 seats upstairs on the lookout, which is a fabulous bar overlooking the uh, lake. And I'm going to be adding a rooftop food truck up there in the next couple of weeks to serve food up there for our guests. And it's quite a unique thing, uh, first ever rooftop food truck. So a lot of things are happening in the water. All right, Mike, you know I'm coming out for that, especially the food truck. Love it. I love the idea of being out here on the water. If you haven't been, make sure you come on out. And we've got the complete list, the top seven patios in Metro Detroit at WXYZ.com. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio. I'm gonna go get some food with Mike. <laughs> I, you know, we're we're a little envious right now. I won't lie. Uh, looks like you're <laughs> at a perfect place for breakfast by the water. Thank you, Matthew, for that update. Now, hey, Thank you know you. what? All of you early risers out there, we want to hear from you. 